Well, Clark, this game is brought to you in HGTV by LG. Life's good. John Cal, Tom Eads, Ted Valentine, the officials who have the honor of being selected to govern the title game. Zubek and Matt Howard, who suffered that mild concussion on Saturday, about to jump it up. Big size advantage here for Zubek, but Howard is able to control the tip back to Norred. This is going to be a fascinating matchup right here. Norred and Nolan Smith. Oh, there are those quick hands that Coach Krzyzewski was concerned about with this team. But Nolan Smith puts it up quickly for two. To make sure they do that as many chances as they get. Thomas left open. Zubak taps it in. He has been a monster on the offensive glass in the NCAA tournament. Almost five offensive rebounds a game. The going, Jim, just have not been able to convert. They've got to knock down these good shots they've been getting. Smith goes right around Howard. And Howard away from the basket. The brothers from Indiana, the Plumleys. And there's a shot from three by Shelvin Mack. Forced Hayward into a tough look. And Shire. Well, we've talked about Matt Howard and how crafty he is, Jim. Shire is much the same way. Sean Van Zandt on the floor for the Bulldogs. And there's another three by Mack. That's now 17 he's made in the NCAA tournament. Chance to stymie Duke. Beasley. Hayward follows it up. Just has a knack to know where to go. Hayward's first points. In games, he's averaged seven points and 10 rebounds a game. This is Han, and he can shoot from out there, as you can see. Shire with the feed. Basket by Thomas. And Jim and keeping his head up so he can see what's available to him. That's Norad. There, he can take advantage of a driving lane if it's available. Singler says, you're going to give it to me. I'm going to take it. It's Van Zandt. They have not really been able to get Hayward too much into the flow at this end of the floor as Van Zant rattles home a two. Had a ball defend defender much like Ronald Norris. Look how low he gets into his stance. Singler with a swish. <laughs> Boy, he is so smooth. Mack challenging Singler and blocked by Zubak. Mack, second chance. And his size gives him a chance to see over people as he passes. Howard battling, tipped up. Yes, Beasley. Contact is very much permissible. Zubak, big height advantage over Hayward. And a weight advantage too, Jim. Tracing. Butler still winning the three-point shooting game, though. But there's one for Duke. Here is Thomas and Duke. Singlet. Great move. Wow. Playing through some contact. That is a terrific move by Singler in a danger zone. Assert himself a little more without Norred on the floor to run things offensively. Oh. That's Jukes, the <laughs> senior. <laughs> what a beautiful stroke. Hit two big ones in the regional final, but not that one. Now Hayward taking on Singler. Beautiful. Gordon Hayward now with four on the game. Question about it. Brad Stevens. Jukes. He can shoot it. For the lead. He can make. Smith, right back, the lead to Duke. I tell you what. Had two ties and nine lead changes in this first half. Shire, he banks it home, spins it around, too. Peter, an advocate for student athletes. On, good pass. Oh, Jukes misses the dunk. Got the follow up, though. How's in there here? Stripped away. Beasley lost it. Shire had it. Smith waiting on the wing. Cans a three. Eight second differential, so Butler can't take the last shot. How about a three by Jukes? Oh, the senior who started his career at Alabama and transferred to Butler, now with 10 off the bench. Raider, as far as recruiting for basketball goes, because he wasn't on the AAU circuit one summer. That is Singler. He's got 12 now on the night. Oh. And they're on pace to take over 70 shots in this game, but they've got to hit a better percentage than they've oh. oh, there's the percentage shot. There it is. Howard. You're... Thomas says, hey, you're not going to respect my outside shot? I'll show you 
defense was trying to help out on the high low as he looked inside to Zubek. And that freed him up for the jump. Norad lays it in. Drives in to put Butler up by two. Every pass challenged. Smith. Wow, tough shot. Extremely tough. Well done by Nolan Smith. Stevens trying to get Howard in there to be a big body to help on the glass. Lobs it. Plumley got it away in time. And it's tipped up and in by John Shire. Beasley taking on Singer here, whips it to the corner. Norad all set, hits the three, and Butler leads by one. There's Jim. They don't have many other big bodies. Got Andrew Smith, Smith the yeah. freshman. Yeah, he's the only guy that's actually. Singler step back three. Caught him napping. Second half's been played within a four point range. A lead of two, either side making now four. Miscommunication that time. A couple of people went to the perimeter, and that left Zubek all alone. This level getting a call from Roddick. It's Thomas. Over Jim. Nicely done. Very assertive move by Lance Thomas. Who... Again, they beat him on the inbounds pass. Shire gave a little nod to Singler, and he just lobbed it up in front of the rim. Biggest lead of this game, either side, was six by Duke. Matt cuts it down to two. He's got possession. Everything and more. Yep. That's Shire. Count the basket. And it's best over these next 450. Singler. He's been dancing all night. Yes, he And has. making sweet music. Dyer. Hayward behind the back, gives it up to Howard, and it bounces in. Minute 40 to go. You don't need it now, though. It doesn't have to be a three now. Let's get a good shot. That's a good shot right there. Howard again on the inside. It's down to one. Ten seconds to go. He wants to drive behind the back. On the baseline, fadeaway shot. Off the rim into Zubak's hands. 3.6 seconds. Well done. First, with that long arm, yep. too, it made... Hayward launch it just a little longer, you would think. Now Zubek for the whole tournament, seven out of twelve at the line, two shots. Zubek makes this. Not going to try. It's Hayward pulling it down, getting around Zubek at midcourt, launches the shot. Oh, and almost went in. Almost went in, and Duke is the king of the dance, 2010.